Hello dear friends welcome to the world of mathematics it's me srija suresh and you are watching ss math solutions today we are going to discuss about the ktet category 3 mathematics questions and answers let's go first question is students evaluation should be continuous comprehensive continuous and comprehensive at the end of course so students evaluation should be so obviously students evaluation should be continuous and comprehensive students evaluation should be continuous and comprehensive moving to next question which is not a technique of motivation try to involve students in making decisions try to avoid competitions introduce variety of teaching techniques which is not a technique of motivation the answer is try to avoid competitions so try to avoid competition is the correct answer from these options let's move to another question which among the following is not related to computer assisted instruction suited only for gifted students suited only for remedial teaching enhances quality of learning which among the following is not related to computer assisted instruction so the answer is suited only for gifted students not related to okay so the answer is suited only for gifted students moving to next question the term curriculum refers to evaluation process in a school syllabus of a course method of teaching and subject matter all the experiences of a child in a school we everybody know that what is a curriculum so these four points are here the correct answer is all the experiences of a child in a school all the experiences of a child in a school so the curriculum means all the experiences of a child in a school let's move to another question for knowing the gaps in children's learning teachers may be advised to contact achievement test diagnostic test prognostic test entrance test so for knowing the gaps in children's learning teachers may be advised to conduct obviously diagnostic test okay so the children's learning gaps anything is there or uh, the we are advised to conduct diagnostic test moving to next question a knowledge of history of mathematics helps a teacher to organize club activities to make the teaching learning process more interesting to enable the students to handle the geometrical instruments to plan the teaching learning activities so a knowledge of history of mathematics helps a teacher to make the teaching learning process more interesting to make the teaching learning process more interesting the sense of appreciation and values corresponds to cognitive domain affective domain psychomotor domain creativity domain so sense of appreciation and values corresponds to affective domain okay the sense of appreciation and values corresponds to affective domain moving to next question the method of teaching which helps spontaneous and incidental learning the method of teaching which helps spontaneous and incidental learning laboratory method lecture method inductive method project method so the answer is project method answer is project method next question individualizing instruction is important individualized instruction is important because children learn differently and at their own pace children learn better in groups teacher get opportunity to maintain discipline feedback is arranged at the end of instruction so individualizing individualized instruction is important because children learn differently and at their own pace so every children will take care of by teacher so individualized instruction is uh, important because children learn differently and at their own pace moving to next question self evident assumption without to proof self evident assumption without to proof is axiom corollary definition theorem obviously the answer is axiom self evident assumption without to proof is axiom 